Hey there YouTube, I have another video today and this is one of the laptops I got with uh, that machine and by the way this has um, Windows 7 installed onto it and everything so I just need to get a power supply for that but I, yeah also I did say that I was going to do both of the laptops um, in one video if you watch the video for that one but um, I just decided to do one at a time I'll close this out here but anyway, this is a compact Presario C700. The uh, label for it is right there. It's kind of hard to see with the camera. And as you can see, it is running Windows 7 on it right now. Um, I got this machine in fully working condition. It had Windows 7, which was, or no, not Windows 7, Windows Vista, which was slow because that's what happens to Windows Vista over time, especially when you don't use it. It just gets really slow and uh, not good to use. Um, this machine had a 160 gigabyte hard drive and uh, 1 gigabyte of RAM but I gave it 2 gigabytes of RAM and um, I just left the hard drive in it and it has a 1.73 gigahertz processor. It has a uh, Pentium dual core in it which is a decent processor for um, a machine like this. I mean obviously you're not going to do like hardcore gaming on here so Pentium dual core will serve this machine just fine. And here we are, that's where it's got the specs and everything. That's good. I'll turn this back a bit. I just sat down in the chair because I didn't feel like standing, so I had to tilt that back. So we'll uh, load up one of my games on it here because I put all my games on it. So, stand back up. Alrighty, here we are, load up the game, and here we go. So we are playing Doom 2, as you can see it runs just fine. Trying my best to do this with one hand, let's take a shot here. Yeah, see, so he's dead now. Alright, so anyway, I'm going to close out of this. Now the graphics chip on here is pretty good. It will play uh, 1080p in uh, YouTube. I downloaded a, a couple movies on here in uh, 1080p and it played those just fine. Um, <clears throat> obviously if you're in a place like at my school where the uh, Wi-Fi is not the best, it's not going to do 1080 too well because if you're watching video, high quality videos on the internet, it, uh, those videos depend on the internet to uh, have good quality, but if you download something onto the desktop, it'll play it just fine. In fact, when I was doing tests with this when I got it, I um, I was uh, playing it in 1080p and it was doing just fine. And I actually barely, it was barely doing 1440. It was dropping frames, but if I had um, if I probably if I gave it some more RAM or um, or I downloaded something onto uh, the desktop that was in 1440p it probably play it just fine but, however I do not think it will do um, 4k video uh, that's I think has just too much for it to handle but it might it might honestly it's this is a I've been using this the past few days for stuff and it's been doing just fine there actually there was one problem I had with it but I addressed it and stuff um, I when I uh, when I got this all running and stuff all fixed up, I noticed that if you hit this part, like right here, this corner, if you hit it, it would blue screen. And the reason why is it was doing that for like three days, and I was trying to be as careful as, a bit very careful with it. But I, it kept blue screening and stuff, and it would lock up if I did that. And then I uh, opened up the RAM door and realized that the RAM card was not properly seated in all the way it was kind of in a bit of an angle so it couldn't so if I opened up too many tabs or whatever also like it would just lock up our blue screen and it wasn't using all the RAM even though it said it could see all two gigabytes it wasn't able to uh, use enough of it to uh, load two pages or uh, two browsers at once or whatever so uh, I fixed that and now it's just fine it can uh, I can load up more as many browsers as I well not as many I mean I am limited to only two gigs of RAM which this machine does run just fine on but 
Yeah, so that's going to be it for this video since I don't have anything else to say about this machine. So I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, subscribe or like and subscribe if you liked it. And I will see you in the next video.